Hey, it's Catherine for my five and a half week update. I just wanted to share how everything is going and a couple of things that happened. The first thing is that I went to see my cardiologist, Dr. Sahu, on Friday. It was a great appointment. We did an echo and an EKG just to make sure that everything was functioning normally, just like it was whenever I was in the hospital. And it was perfect. Uh, they compared the hospital EKG and, sorry, the hospital echo and the echo um, from Friday to make sure that everything was still, uh, that there had been no decrease in function. And there hadn't. My, uh, there are no leaks in my valve and everything is functioning properly. So I'm good to go and set. Uh, we're going to have a three month appointment in April just to make sure things are still going great. Uh, but I'm feeling really good. So um, it's wonderful news and very exciting. Meeting with Dr. Zahi did give me a chance to ask a couple of questions, um, and I had a couple of worries that I wanted to just get off my chest and get his answers for, and I did. Uh, the first one was endocarditis. I was really nervous about uh, my risk of getting that and wanted to make sure I minimized any risk that there was. So I asked him what I should do uh, to make sure that this was not going to be a problem, and he focused. He really said that it's um, I need to focus on my oral hygiene and make sure that I'm brushing and flossing um, every day. Um, you know, blushing more than once a day and keeping my mouth clean, uh, that I'm also avoiding, avoiding the dentist and the orthodontist, which I have no problem in doing that. <laughs> so uh, that'll be good uh, to make sure that I stay safe and well. The other question I had was about caffeine. I know that that can be a problem for some people, and I wanted to make sure that it wasn't a problem for me. So I talked to Dr. Sahu, and he said that I should try to avoid it, but one cup a day is not going to hurt me. Um, and so I'm set for that since that's about all I can handle anyway. So that was a good answer for that and eased my worries there. And uh, the final question I had was about uh, treating my sinuses and allergies whenever they act up. And I found that I cannot do, um, some sinus medicines are bad, uh, that I really need to be careful with my decongestants to make sure that it's not like Sudafed and doesn't have um, the same uh makeup as, as that. So that'll be something that when I get sick, I do have to talk to the pharmacist about. Uh, but otherwise, I should be set and good for that. Besides my appointment, uh, as for my overall recovery, it's going really well. Uh, my pain has come back in my back and my shoulder. I think I'm just sleeping funny trying to avoid my chest. Um, but I'm hoping that that'll go down again soon. Uh, and I'm trying to keep working out to try to ease that pain as well and kind of loosen it up. So we'll see. Uh, I've not had a migraine since my surgeon appointment, which was two weeks ago, so that's really good news. I feel like I'm out of the loop there and not going to have that problem again, so fingers crossed. Um, and th So that's my main recovery state. Otherwise, not really feeling much pain in the chest. The hardest part is not moving uh, my arms above my head because I'm feeling so comfortable now. So I've got a couple more days and I can do it. I can wait, so that's good. Um, and then for my status update, just on activity-wise, things are going really great. Uh, this past weekend, we went shopping for three hours with my sister, and I will have to say that I was the least tired out of everybody, which was great. Uh, so that was fun, um, and I kind of ha had so much energy, it was, not, it was crazy. Um, <clears throat> besides that, I've also been doing a little bit of working out. I climbed five flights of stairs the other day, which was impressive uh, for me. I was out of breath at the top, but I did it, so that's what mattered. Uh, and I've also spent today going up and down my street, which was pretty long, about um, five laps, and intermeeting with that with a little bit of jogging as well uh, to try to kind of push my endurance up and get better and stronger in that area. I'm excited about this coming week whenever I can finally uh, be released from any restrictions, and I think I'm going to really work on trying to push my endurance a little bit, get a little bit stronger and more able so that is the plan. Uh, that is this past week. That's what's been going on. And uh, that is my status update. I will update you at the six-week point um, and share a little bit about how things are going. But I'm really excited with my progress and just wanted to share it with you guys. So thank you. Bye.